BRCA officially stands for Breast Cancer Early Onset. Um, there is a BRCA1 and a BRCA2 gene. We find that when a person has an abnormality or a genetic mutation in BRCA1, depending on the type of mutation, these could evolve or predispose an individual to a higher risk for uh, breast or ovarian cancer if you're a woman. BRCA2 has um, a mutation spectrum in not just breast in the ovary, but uh, a variety of different uh, cancers like colon and pancreatic. So essentially these genes, although they're similar in sequence, the spectrum of cancers that um, eventually evolve from these mutations are slightly different. We found that there are some mutations that occur in BRCA1 that may not necessarily predispose a person. So um, it's a very, very large gene and there's an opportunity of mutations across the entire DNA sequence. And it's not uh, entirely clear which particular mutations lead to uh, the predisposition for cancer. Typically, those who are at a higher risk for development of breast cancer are those who have um, someone in their family, be it on their mom or their dad's side, that have already been diagnosed with a particular cancer. If they do find a family history, make sure they align themselves with a genetic counselor who can explain to them um, what a positive or negative test would mean should they choose to be tested for BRCA1.